Hey everybody, Edo here, and I want to talk to you today about AI art. Now, people have been talking about AI art on Facebook and social media. It's been coming along for years now and progressively getting better and better, and there have been a variety of different sites and AIs that you can use there. But I wanted to take a moment and talk about mid-journey and what I think is now us stepping over that, that, that line. If you are a board game publisher, board game designer, Kickstarter creator, or board game artist, or artist in general, I think it is absolutely essential you take a look at what's happening in this space right now um, and get familiar with it. I, I think people have been used to seeing images that are off or like scary or a little bit like dark, um, but the reality is... Uh, it's progressed to a place where you can make absolutely fantastic, extremely high resolution stuff. And what the behavior we're seeing is people are now getting good at figuring out what to ask the AI to make, and therefore the AI then makes better stuff. And by making better stuff, it learns to make better stuff, and and and, and it's coming along. Um, people are like, oh, do you think you could make a board game with, with AI art? Absolutely. And and whether or not that's good and, and you know, you can go through like what the impact is to the scene, but I really think it's important. You're going to be seeing uh, this AI art as an opportunity for designers and folks who aren't artists to explore and think about new ideas, even if they're going to use an artist, but just sort of like look at and learn. And then I think you're going to see more and more artists actually using it to sort of jumpstart their work and then take it from there. Or you'll just see projects that start with um, this work from AI and then get some cleanup. There are some really interesting terms of service and rules now that allow for commercial use, though you really have to read the fine print because in some ways it's like, you can use this for commercial use, but it also has to be public domain, um, which is really like an interesting thing that you can consider. But what I wanted to do was actually... I, I think you just need to see it. And I think people think it's really complicated or confusing or just like haven't jumped into it. So I'm just going to flip the, the camera around I, and just with a new account, jump on and just like show you what I've been seeing. I'll, I'll All right. So the first thing you're going to do here is go to midjourney.com. Uh, you, you know, once you can just, you know, you can just use that to get here. It's going to give you all this other stuff. I'm sure it's doing all the, a lot of tracking, but we'll set that aside. And then there's a, a bunch of information at the bottom, but, and I know this looks very not art heavy, but it, you're just going to hit join the beta. Now, if you don't have discord, you'll need discord. I'm not going to go through how to do that, but you hit join the beta and then it'll do the discord thing and it'll bring up this and say, join mid journey. Okay. Cool. I've joined the server. Now you'll also get a message from them saying, hey, um, you're on the server. You're going to want to go and join a newbie channel, which I'll do. And you're going to want to type the word imagine. And that's how you start the magic. So I'll go to the server, all sorts of things in here. But then there's like amazing amount of newbie channels. And I don't know. I'm going to go to newbie. Newbie's 94. So as soon as you're going to get in here, you're just going to start seeing the incredible art. Now, when you submit, and I'll do a couple, somebody said, Yangon City like look like a cyber city. And so what'll happen is you'll first get four conceptual images. Uh, and again, I'll do this. And then from there, you can uh, hit these buttons, which allow you to um, you know, do it again. But more importantly, you can up level, up res one of the images like you like really want it to get sharper and sharper, which is super cool. Or you can get variants based on those other images. Now, again, you are going to get a variety of stuff here. Some of this is more graphic than others. But I'm going to just keep scrolling down here. And you can see how people are starting to explore and, and, and move around. A lot of these are totally different styles, not all dark. There's certainly a lot of fantasy in here, for sure. But you can see as things start getting up-leveled, uh, this is somebody who might have said Geiger in here. Uh, 1980s Clash of the Titans Med Medusa. Um, you see things moving up. This person had picked some more variants. If I go upwards, let me see. Um, again, I, I've pulled some of different types. But, you know, I mean, this stuff is starting to get incredible, uh, especially as they get these bigger and bigger from their sets. This was City, Tomb, Dark Sky, right? Very simple information in here. But again, it's not all dark. This was anime with cute face. All right, moving along. Now you could pick like here, even I didn't do this, but I could go to this face here, which is interesting. And I could, that's it's one, two, three, four. And I could say, hey, let me get four variants of that. So it's starting to think. 
and then some here back at the bottom. And you know, the Discord's scrolling and, and uh, you know, uh, updating is a little bit annoying. But if I go here, it should. Uh, there you go. It's in the middle. It's at 21 percent, 69 percent. It'll keep updating, and then it'll get to 100 percent. And I'm going to do our own. But I mean, it's just like, oh, okay, cool. So it made some different variants. They're pretty cool. Let's get a closer look here. It's going to finish uh, and post. Let's look here. I mean, there's a lot of interesting things. The the cute anime face, but with the little the the like uh, leaves or or, or uh, um, apples here. I don't know. Let's let's take some of them are a little bit more creepy, right? And some of them sometimes the eyes are a little weird. But let's go to this one over here and see what happens, which is that V4. But now instead of variants, I'm going to up level it. Oops, that wasn't the one I wanted. I wanted this one. You have to get used to Discord. It is a little um, annoying at times to how much it's going on. So. Yeah, I hit that button on the Yangon City, but now it's just right. It's working on up leveling and up level and increasing the fidelity on that piece. Now this is a pretty simple piece, um, but you know, I mean, the the speed at which this is generated is crazy. Uh, it is crazy. So while that's thinking, uh, and and when you 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 do this like sample membership, you come in, you um, don't get you, you're gonna get like two twenty two hundred images. Um, but you know, um, yeah, who is this photorealistic Richard Nixon? That'll be a funny one, and that'll keep coming up. But, like, let's say, okay, so let's do our own. I want to say, imagine so you, there are a bunch of different prompts you can get, but this is the key one, and then I don't know, um, let's say, you know, we're doing something fantasy, like, let's, I don't know, let's try cartoony, um, elves in a field right let's see what things now you can say like in the style of you can name artists but let's just see what we get for cartoony elves in a field it's thinking it's waiting to start there's a little bit of a queue again if you are a membership and like again the, the like the normal membership is like ten dollars a month the the mega membership is 30 that seems like a lot oh well those are that photorealistic richard dixon right again this is crazy Right? Like, you know, maybe if I zoomed in here, the eyes could be a little weird. There might be a little element. But again, depending on you, if you're making scythe, right? Like, you know, there is some cleanup that you need to do on these, perhaps. But if, like, scythe is an. <laughs> so I'm getting a little bit more no <laughs> garden gnomes in here, but uh, we're getting some interesting stuff here as it's coming along. Now, really, though, part of it, too, is starting to explore picking images and going from there, right? Like, I don't really like these. The 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 oh, the, the, somebody somehow it made a decision that like oh maybe elves don't have hats like that and they have big ears, so you know we're getting these variants. But maybe there's something interesting about here, right? So you can go in here and I can say okay, I want to go back to that third one, and I want to see some variants on that third one. Um, and you know. I'm doing this live. I didn't pre. -pro I mean, you could you can't even pre pre do this, but. If and I'll, I'll jump into some other rooms. You can you can see what people are doing as they're learning and asking better questions. Um, there there was a really amazing one. I mean, like uh, you know, like these cyberpunk ones like um, come up a bunch. It's like uh, 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 you know, uh, ro rogue. Cyber. Oh, I have to do that. Imagine again, and then you say like rogue, um, cyberpunk, and then like a lot of times they'll say 8K. You're not gonna get 8K, but um, it's you know it's just I think it gives it the idea that you want it rendered, 3D rendered men working on the gym. Again, I, I this is all happening live, folks. Or not live, but like it's all being recorded. Maybe I'll have to. Um, you know, crop some things. But let's see what we got here. I wonder if they're going to give me rogue, as in like actually rogue. Oh, they got clothing on, they got pants on, that's pretty good. So it's coming along here. Um, but you can imagine, right, like even if I'm not in here saying I want to do this, like even if I'm not saying I want to use these one-to-one, -one, even the idea of being like, hmm, I've got this idea. <laughs> oh, it's putting the word, did I misspell it? No, I didn't. Uh, putting the idea in here that to have this stuff is incredible. I'm going to do I'm going to do that the close up of the face and then I'm going to up level it and we'll see what we actually I'm I'm, I'm torn.
I mean, whoa, look at these. Anime Girls illustrated by uh, Asangi. I assume that's somebody who, um, you know, is this is their style. So actually, I want to up. I think I can do it even though it wasn't mine. I'm going to up level four on this one, and I'm going to run out soon. Here are those bodybuilders. But here, I think this these are both cool. So I'm going to... I'm gonna up level, let's do this. Let's up level four and get variance on one. In a second, it's gonna cut me off. Um, but, you know, I mean, those muscle men getting ripped, uh, the face variation here, uh, that was, this is the upscaling starting to happen. And I think there's even one more upscale you can do. Um, but, you know, I'm not saying these images are perfect. But it's also not just like, oh, horror. Oh, I think people were used to seeing um, stuff like, oh, I want to see a Picasso or, you know, Van Gogh and, and, you know, just trying to hit art styles. But just sit in one of these channels for like just a few minutes and you just start seeing how, how incredible uh, it is. This one came along now based on what I have. I mean, look look at their, their it's it's doing the different, you know, it, it's very on. It's very getting it. This person's still trying to figure out where their muscle men are. You're going to see more and more of this in magazines. Like somebody did maps and they were getting map renders that looked exactly like maps. So I'm going to like let this roll get to the 100% here on these on these renders and then I'm going to um I'm going to go, but I'm 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 really just and then maybe hit another channel or something, but it is it is Okay, so here they did the variations in there. Oh, okay, is this almost 80%, 93%? Um, I think I picked, this wasn't the one I wanted to pick. That's too bad. Um, and uh, it's crazy. I mean, in, in, and again, it's crazy when you think about like the ones where they're just picking an art style, like, like an artist. Um, but, you know, there are 88%. I wonder why this one, this is like a wide scale, I wonder if that's why it's taking that extra time um so it's it's crazy and like you know this is one channel uh of here so there it goes it's gonna now drop it at the bottom i think it's gonna say he's done i did that That was a favorite whoever was also looking at that or is it up here um it is you know you could just see yourself staring at this so oh, it's 16 by 9 was the request right it's crazy uh let's just dump into another room quickly like here's here's just this isn't it's totally different totally different stuff going on here right and you can see it develop you can see people asking different questions and getting different results and learning right um you know it does it doesn't it, there isn't a stop i mean again this is this is transformative technology that we, you're, we are going to all be seeing more and more. I'm not trying to espouse one thing or another, but I absolutely think that if you're in this space, you should at least check this out. Um, again, like stuff that this just looks like crystal renders, right? What was it? The Diamond 4K. That's what that person asked for. Um, beautiful house behind waterfall with colorful rainbow. <laughs> that was a little intense. What is this? Green triangle shaped man camping in woods. Uh, cinematic, AK, hyperdeck, you know. So crazy. So crazy. Okay. Um, that's your demo. Check it out on your own. Really. Thanks. Bye. Hey, everybody. Edo here. And thanks for watching Gaming with Edo. Reviews over here on this playlist. League and Insider videos over here on this one. Subscribe. Share. All that good stuff, but most importantly, play some great games. Thanks. Bye.